Hey guys, it's us again, and we love movies. Hey everybody! Hi! Hello, hello. Well, summer's still here, and it's time for a big action movie. So what's the movie? Today we're watching... B2 Cruise Control. Oh. Uh... Hey, this got two thumbs up by Cisco and Ebert, so it's gotta be good. Right? Um... So kick it, Keanu! And now, tonight's feature presentation. Alright, Speed 2, directed by Jean Deton, came out in 1997, and here we go. We see Annie played again by Sandra Bullock, and she has taken a slapstick driving lesson with comic legend Tim Conway. Ha <laughs> ha! She's destroying property! Well, during this, she explains the entire exposition, why Keanu's not in this, and her new boyfriend Alex, played by Jason Patrick, is a beach cop. No, nope, he's not. Turns out Alex is actually SWAT, but never told her. Annie's very mad about this, but he bribes her back with cruise tickets. Well played, Alex. Well played. So now we're on the cruise ship, and here's the cast we're supposed to care about. Oh, there's Willem Dafoe. And it's here we really see the romantic chemistry between Annie and Alex. There's Willem Dafoe again. And he's John Grieger, and it seems like he's up to no good. So now this movie's still about a half hour in, and literally nothing is going on. Oh, Grieger killed the captain. And now the fire alarms are going off and they have to abandon the ship. But Alex smells sulfur and thinks something's going on. So as they're abandoning the ship, Alex and Annie split up. And now they spend about 20 minutes on this lifeboat rescue, which has nothing to do with moving the story along. Two people, we don't even know who they are, die. Uh, yeah, it was totally your fault. So now we finally learn that Grieger is stealing some diamonds. He used to make cruise ships, but got sick, so was fired. And wants revenge by running this cruise ship into an oil tanker. Huh? Well, after a lot of scenes of Alex apparently knowing a lot more about the ship than the actual crew, Giger kidnaps Annie, and the ship misses the oil tanker, and I don't care. Oh, now the ship's heading for the shore. Well, this is not a boat accident. Wait, isn't Annie kidnapped still? Oh yeah, there they are. Well, they go to Krieger's plane. And dude, seriously, just get rid of her now and get out of there. Oh, okay, take her on the plane with you. Good idea. Oh, Alex to the rescue, and the plane somehow crashes on top of a pole. And, well, blows up. Alex proposes to Annie, thank God, because we were all so concerned and rooting for them. And the end. So that was the wild, nail-biting action masterpiece, Speed 2. I wanna die! Now it's time for the trivia question we never asked. The answer? Clubber Lang! How do I put this gently? This movie f***ing sucked. It was really bad. Both story and technically. Sandra Bullock's in a bikini, so I'm sold. Yes, she is, but the movie itself just isn't fun. The first speed had a ridiculous premise, and we all know that, but it was executed so well that you were totally into it. This one also had a very ridiculous premise, and it was executed poorly. And that's where it fails. There was no fun to it, it wasn't entertaining, and everybody looked really, really bored making it. I'm sure Sandra Bullock's bikini wasn't bored. <laughs> Pretty sure William Dafoe was auditioning for the Joker. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I generally like Jason Patrick, but boy is his character boring. And you can just see the pain in his eyes of having to do this. Sandra Bullock, she's being Sandra Bullock, and comes off as really annoying at some point. That's not the actor's fault, it's just such a badly written script. Let us know what you thought about Speed 2, Cruise Control. We want to know if you liked it, and more importantly, why. Yeah, if you liked it, let us know why. And if you've been watching our videos and haven't subscribed yet, do it! Let us know what movies you want us to watch, and we will see you next time. Bye! 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 It's not personal, sir. It's strictly business. Let's kick it. I'll say kick it, and you'll just kick it with a tasty groove, okay? One, two, three, kick it. Kick it, come on. God damn it! God! What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. You stay classy.